everyone today I will explain you how to download sequencing data using SRA toolkit and uh, for that uh, I will uh, show you all the steps using my mm, computer here the first thing what you need to do is to you should know the steps that what are the steps for downloading or installing the SRA toolkit for downloading sequencing data you can just search download SRA toolkit in Ubuntu and uh, you can see the any any link you can click here the first one like for example installing a SRA toolkit using Ubuntu you need to download this file for that you need to have uh, use this, this command this one yeah to get the zip file and after downloading this you have to unzip that file using this command and then you have to set the path of your uh, folder and then you can check by uh, clicking the which a fast queue dump and you can see that uh, your path is also set so first I will create one directory like I'm creating a test directory and here you can see that in this there is nothing so first thing I will do is to uh, download the SRA toolkit zip file into this folder so this is the this is the command you can just copy and paste here in this in this folder and here you can see that all the files are now downloading uh, and it will take few seconds and then the download will be complete and the next thing is you have to unzip using this command we just copy this command here and uh, paste it again in the terminal and you can see that uh, yes this is the zip file and you can just see that now the file is unzipped here so after that uh, what you have to do is to set the path of this folder right like this is the path of this folder uh, I, you, I can copy this but this, this is specifically for Mac and I'll write here export uh, path equals dollar path colon pwd uh, SRA tool kit this is the version of my uh, SR tool kit so 0.3.0.0 dash uh, Ubuntu 64 Ubuntu 64 yeah and uh, slash bin right so I will just I will just enter this one I'll just check it one time yeah it's done right uh, enter yeah so now if you want to check it you can just write which fast queue uh, dash dump and you can see that the folder is set to the home for hunt test SRA toolkit uh, bin and fast queue right so now what I need to do is to configure right what I'm doing is so, so quick configuration guide you need to use this command and in this command you can just you can use this command to configure your uh, uh, your your SRA toolkit like now I just I, I'm just making one more test one directory where I want to download the files so yes so in this file I will download all the uh, uh, in future I will download all the sequencing data using the SRA toolkit commands uh, wait let me let me configure it uh, so here I just write vdb dash config space minus i and yeah, enter and here you can see that you can use the uh, you can set any directory you want uh, I'm, I want to set here test one so you can use mouse to navigate but uh, uh, the most easiest way is to use the tab and enter for example here I have selected the tab and yes in main I will just click enter and here I will choose the location so for the location yeah this one is with that test folder the test folder is yeah this is the test folder in this test one I am setting it as a directly then click tab ok save yes 
and then again uh, save everything what I've done here and then OK and then exit yeah so now if I just write uh, fastq dump then you can see that it the the command will easily run here so for, for example I've just used the the this one fastq dash dump minus std uh, out and the name of the of the uh, sequencing data and then yes I want to paste the first eight lines and just click enter now it will uh, now it's downloading and if I will just it will just paste the first few lines of the sequencing file here and then it will uh, stop downloading here so you can see yeah so you can see that now the fast Q files are are downloaded and it's completely working so you can use this uh, one for your uh, to configure your SRA toolkit in your Ubuntu